hi i'm Carmen shamas i'm your astrologer how is monday the 7th of june going to be with the moon in taurus this should be a very nice day if you're taurus if you're virgo if you're um, uh, capricorn also if you're cancer and if you are uh, pisces knowing that tomorrow tuesday the moon will also be in taurus let's start with aries so aries today is a very active a very uh, re responsive day it responds to you it responds to your actions so for every action there's a reaction today and most probably the reactions are going to be very positive and very empowering so all you have to do is plan well and go ahead with your day taurus with the moon in your sign it seems you have the all the energy or you have energy enough to uh, embark on a journey a small journey a big journey uh, um, a huge journey it can be anything it can be just as simple as um, uh, as moving furniture around uh, trying to um, start a new style maybe or maybe starting a new diet or shifting things it can be as simple as that as that or maybe it can be as big as um, moving mountains like um, uh, relocating or um, uh, immigrating or anything it can be anything under the influence of the moon in your sign this can be a great day everybody can be uh, happy everybody can be lucky today gemini it's a slow day uh, with the moon in taurus every single time the moon is in taurus you have to know that it can be a very slow day it can be a little bit frustrating or it can be a little bit delaying meaning that everything is stalling everything takes time nothing seems to work out uh, uh, correctly so it can be anything today Gemini it's a beautiful day if you want to spend it doing nothing um, just a few simple things uh, simple chores at home at work at the office anywhere uh, if you have nothing to do that's even more perfect even more perfect so uh, all important chores leave them till Wednesday or Thursday that's when the moon reaches your sign in the meantime take it easy mind your own business let's move now to cancer it's a nice day with the moon in Taurus it seems as if you have some uh, 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 more people or um, you have extra help it seems that you're not going to be on your own you're not going to be let down people seem to 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 flock to you around you they want to be around you maybe they want to help or maybe they just maybe they sense that you have some positive energy today so people just always people flock uh, around people who have uh, positive energy or around people who have um, a lot of energy you know this is the, these are the energy vampires you know so you have to be careful with that you know why because on on wednesday and thursday you're going to need every every ounce of energy you know because it's going to be uh, rather tough on wednesday and thursday okay so back to um back to monday uh today cancerians uh, i think you should invest in this uh, in this day because it is going to be very helpful planet venus brings great luck if you were born on the 27th 28th of june and be extra careful if you were born on the 20th 21st of july that's uh, mars uh, warning you let's move now to leo leo with the moon in the highest point in your sky i think today is the day of good work you have to do well you have to show them that you really know what you're doing that you are in the right place at the right time it can be tough today it depends if your job position is high or not in all cases whatever you do you have to do it well you don't want to shame yourself so you don't want to people point at you saying that you failed or that you did this and that um, you know so you have to be ready since the early morning and uh, don't let yourself down moving to virgo i think virgos today should enjoy that you should enjoy a beautiful day a beautiful cooperating day a beautiful uh, empowering day because the moon is in taurus you seem that you seem to understand things you assimilate things quite instantaneously there is no need for you to worry about not um, interested in in these subjects or those subjects because today everything is easy to you just just like that uh, a piece of cake so today not only it's easy i think today is also lucky quality of time is good uh, especially so if you have big um, 
meetings today, go ahead and do them. Today is one of the best days in this week. Let's move now to Libra. Libra with the moon in Taurus, you seem to be recalculating certain points, which is fine. I think you can be very successful. Everything seems to be meaningful. This is true. And uh, uh, my advice to you is not to leave your home or your house without your papers, your ID. Um, even if you're going to a bank or you're going to any, any administrative place, any office, and uh, you're doing some paperwork, make sure that you have them all covered. Make sure that you have everything with you because today it's all about details. It's about little things and about um, people, uh, professional people who want to make sure that you know that they know more. So <laughs> this is the whole point. You can be very lucky if you were born on the 6th, 7th of October and you can be lucky if you were born on the 9th, 10th of October. Uh, moving to Scorpio, because the moon is in Taurus, you may feel challenged at a certain point during the day and it can be anything and it can be something, meaning that it can be something as simple as someone uh, someone who was shouting on the street and you were sleeping and you feel that they bothered you. It can be just something like that. This really... Um, um, uh, puts you in a mood, let's say, or it can be something, uh, uh, something big as a, as a, as a problem at home or with work with your children. It can be anything. It depends on how you want to handle it. If you're careful enough, uh, you can let it go, you know, just forgive and forget. And this is my advice to forgive and forget. Moving to uh, Sagittarius, it's going to be a very, very, very long, long, long Monday. And it's going to be a long, long Tuesday. And it's going to be a longer, longer, longer day on Wednesday and Thursday. So you get the idea. Four long days, four troubling days. Uh, today is better than uh, Wednesday and Thursday. So if there's important stuff that you really, really need to finish within these four days, today and tomorrow are the most convenient. There you go. Uh, Capricorn, it's a uh, it's, uh, Taurus moon. It's a happy moon. It's a love romance kind of moon. So it gives you uh, a huge dose of uh, creativity, of positivity, of, um, of, uh, of good luck, and uh, it empowers you. Uh, most probably it will attract uh, benefits and uh, favorable situations and uh, best of results. So there you are. Enjoy this beautiful day and don't uh, stay behind. Don't lag behind. Uh, try to be one of the first comers. Try to be one of the winners because today you can be a winner. Everybody is lucky today. Let's move now to Aquarius. Aquarius with the moon in the fourth house. It's the house of, um, of home. You know, it's your house, uh, it's, uh, it's family, it's all about you, how you feel inside, how you need to pamper yourself, how you take care of yourself. It can be a bit nostalgic. In all cases, uh, uh, Aquarians are not that sentimental after all, but today you can be a little bit moody. You know, things may upset you a little bit. So what you have to do is try to uh, flow with it. Uh, try not to make something out of nothing. Um, Maybe. So if you feel a little bit uh, moody, just let it be. Because remember that the sun being in Gemini, it is still a beautiful day. So most probably you will end up either discussing something with your kids or maybe you're just uh, busy preparing something for them. And uh, maybe you are a little bit impatient. It's it shouldn't be more than that. But because planet Saturn is in your sign near your birthday, you have to be very, very careful if you are born on the second or the third of um of February. On the other hand, you can be lucky if you were born on the 5th, 6th of February. Let's move now to Pisces. Pisces. Okay, so Pisces, what, what, what is the problem with Pisces? There's no problem with Pisces. No problem whatsoever with Pisces. With the moon in Taurus, you seem to be the most um, original, the most exo exotic uh, planner and one of the most influential signs today. With the moon in Taurus, your mind seems to be running on full, full revolution, uh, meaning turning very, very fast, re revolving very fast. Um, you're quick to assimilate things. You're quick to get things. You're quick to understand things. 
and you're going to be uh, you're going to amaze us everybody uh, it's uh, it will help you be creative with your work with your interests whatever job you have whatever chores you have this is going to be a very beautiful day uh, so if you think that somebody needs an answer from you i think today you can answer them you still have also tuesday so mentally and physically you are totally switched on everybody can be lucky especially those born on the 21st of february basically this is it i wish you all a great day and see you tomorrow enjoy bye bye